stayed with Wells there after that second inning. Uh, we pivoted from our original game plan. Um, you know, tip your cap to them. They came out and they uh, they got off to the heater. Uh, they did some damage early, and then uh, you know, we pivoted, and he did a really good job of pitching from that point on. How? What was making Detmer stuff? Man, he uh, he he was commanding his fastball pretty good at the top of the zone, and um, I guess command's probably not the right word. He's using it at the top of the zone. Uh, and uh, we never really got on top of it. And then um, he was using his slider and his changeup, you know, off of that. And he did a really good job of keeping us off balance as a lineup. Was that, that pick on Ohapi it called, or did you just kind of see him move back too far? No, he was, uh, you know, down the line quite a bit. Um, you know, we got a contact guy at the plate. Typically, two outs isn't a great time to try and back pick at third, but uh, you know, trying to limit damage. And if they're going to give us a free out, we're going to take it. And I threw it into his back instead of inside the line. And um, if I had to do it again, I'd, I wouldn't not call it. I'd just throw it on the inside part of the bag because he's out by five feet. After you, got, after you guys had such strong offensive days, first two games, you getting excited about maybe being part of it and then disappointed that you couldn't uh, build on that? Yeah, I mean, that, that's baseball, though, right? Um, you know, just because you have two really good games offensively doesn't mean that you're going to have three. And just like if you have two really bad offensive games doesn't mean it's going to be another bad one. Um, that's the beauty of 162 games is you're going to have your ups, you're going to have your downs as an individual and as a team. And today we just didn't, uh, didn't click.